John and CCSD students head back to school in a couple of weeks. While you may be shopping for supplies, you also may be considering their health. Bianca Holman is live with Back to School Dental Care to tell us more about it. Hey there, Bianca. Hey, good morning, Hector. So, yeah, we're here at Union Village Kids Dental Care, and we're talking about all back to school health. So, I'm joined here by Dr. Tucker. So, getting our kids ready for the school year, how do you find a pediatric dentist? So, when you're looking for a dentist for your child, especially a young child, I would highly recommend finding a pediatric dentist. That's because we're trained to manage children of all ages, children that may not be fully cooperative or may have any growth or development issues. We handle all of that. So, it's a really good thing to do. Yeah. And also, so again, getting back to school, getting these teeth nice and pearly white for they're ready for school and everything like that. Tell us why dental care is so important before the start of school. So it's really important because untreated issues that may cause pain, they can affect the child's sleep, mm -hmm. they can affect attention span in school, and that may affect in behavior changes or problems with attention span and just poor performance. Yeah. So we do have a model here, Donovan. Good morning, Donovan. Hey, so you're going to show us, Dr. Tucker, flossing. It's so important. I know even as an adult, we sometimes get frustrated with flossing. What are some tips that you have? So when you're flossing for your child, sometimes it's a little difficult to use the string floss. So we recommend the little floss picks, and those are really easy to use because you can just gently go back and forth. Can you open for me, Donovan? Good job. You can go back and forth between the teeth, and that just makes it easy, kind of keeps your fingers out of the mouth to avoid any problems there. And then if your child is a little more cooperative and you uh, are a little more bold, you can go ahead with the string floss, which is a little more effective. What we like to do is just tie a little knot in it like that. What that does is it just catches any debris that's stuck between the teeth, and then you just gently drag that knot through the teeth, and that really helps clear in between them, and that can help keep your smile nice and healthy. All right, perfect. I swear, Dr. Tucker, if I had you as a dentist growing up, I probably wouldn't have had those cavities, all right? I know Donovan is probably going to have great teeth as well. So, again, all great tips. We got some more coming up in the next half hour as we talk about dental care as our kids head back to school. Back to you guys in the studio.